let me break down the season real quick for this 12-team new college football playoff scheduling format. So we know the last game of the regular season, Rivalry Week, is on Thanksgiving, yep. which means the next week after that is your conference championships. That's the first week of December. The week after that is always slated for the Army-Navy game, which is a time-honored tradition. It's always played by itself, which means the earliest you could play this first round of games uh, which we know now are going to be on campus, which I think is great. I that's love exciting. it. Exciting. That's the Friday, Saturday of December twentieth and twenty first. So that's three games. They're talking about maybe playing one on a Friday night, a couple on a Saturday, something like that. The quarterfinals are the Sugar Fiesta, Peach, and Rose. So that'll be on New Year's Eve and New Year's Day, which is what the semifinals used to be. Think yep. about. Uh, uh, Buckeyes in Georgia last year on New Year's Eve. So then you have the semifinals now move to that time slot that used to be the national championship, except they're talking about either a Thursday and or a Friday night of January 9th and 10th, which means the national championship game, because they still want to have it for some reason on a Monday, be January 20th. So uh, again, to your point, I don't understand here. Either one, just go ahead and compete with the NFL, which you know they won't do, but let's really make people decide. Just put the national championship game on that Saturday and the semifinals on that Saturday, and let's figure out what people want to watch, which you know they won't do, or just go ahead and pick that Friday night to just play it, Friday. and then don't give a full 10-day turnaround for the national championship. If you're going to play the semifinals on a Friday night, which they're talking about now, Play the national championship one week later. Why do we need 10 days to play it on a Monday night? Nobody can give me a good reason. I'm sure somebody on social media would be like, well, this, this, it. No, 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 no. There's not a good reason why we don't play this on. Imagine that. Imagine Friday, college football national championship game. Rest of the weekend, NFL playoffs. Greatest weekend ever. But we don't. And I don't know why. Or you could move the season up one week, which who doesn't want to get to college football quicker? But that still doesn't solve the Monday night championship game Yeah, problem. it's the worst idea ever, and whoever did it should be exiled. I don't know if we exile people anymore. I think you either just throw them in jail or extradite them back to where they committed the crime. But we need to find out who whoever did this. I don't care who they are. I don't care if they're the, the a commissioner of a league. They need to be exiled from the United All States. All right, I did it. <laughs> I David, I'm you sorry. did it, David. I'm sorry. All right, good. Hey, he's in. He's a real in here. get off my lawn type of moment for me. Yeah, go ahead and send in the honest. team. Let's get him. When it comes down to betting on sports, and if you're in an area where you're able to do it, if you don't have a sports book yet, there's only one option. That is DraftKings Sportsbook. They are the best in the business. And if you download the app now and sign up with our code Crane, that's C R A I N, new customers can make a five dollar bet and score $150 in bonus bets instantly. That's only at DraftKings Sportsbook. Use our code CRANE, that's C-R-A-I-N, not spelled like the bird. We've got NHL playoffs, NBA playoffs, college baseball, UFC, golf, everything going on, Cone. I'm hopping back on the Nerfy train. No runs first inning and a little NHL playoffs. Leafs, don't let me down. Yeah, you've been on the Nerfy train for... I've never got off of it. It's the train that I live on on a daily basis. I'm actually homeless on it. So I go from city to city. So you're a hobo that's nerfy training. Yes, I'm nerfy training right now. Wow. Look, NBA playoffs, NHL playoffs, baseball coming around. It doesn't get better than this. Yeah, I would do uh, Even though they only gave up 97 points the other night, every game the Suns play from here on out, I'd take the uh, mm-hmm. Nuggets to hit whatever the uh, over is on team total points. So make sure you download the sport, uh, DraftKings Sportsbook app. Use our code CRANE. College football games belong on Saturdays. <laughs> All right. I don't care what game it is, the first game of the season, conference championship, bowl game, or national championship. What about Maction? Co- even Maction. All right. Maction? I want college football on Saturdays. Because Saturdays for what? The boys. It's for the, for the boys. boys. And college football and beer drinking and tailgate. I can't go drink beer and tailgate on a Thursday. All right. Really? I have to wake up and do stuff Friday morning. Like get up at five and come do a show and talk about things like this. College football belongs on a Saturday, and then that goes into what? Eight hours of me sitting on a couch watching my fantasy team disappoint me on a Sunday. All right. So you're not There's for any weekday thing. games? Huh? No weekday games like no. you said, Maction? No One games on Saturday. Well, Wednesday night. As many games possible. See, I, I, again, I, I don't want to conflate the two. I'm talking about the national championship game or even the semifinal. Hell, I'll, I'll do you one better, David. Any of the playoff games. Any of the playoff games. Because if we're going to do college football on Saturday, that means you can only play bowl games on Saturday. That's never going to work with the amount of Mm -hmm. bowls. I like going through the week of the regular season and saying, hey, guess what? Monday night football in the NFL, I'll take that. Not a championship game. Tuesday, Maction, once it happens, great. Wednesday, Fun Belt, Sun Belt, I'm down with that. I just don't want the championship game. 
You can flood. I wish they played a college football game on every every day. How about Friday nights during the fall? L- love it. Because see, traditionally, I'm against. Yeah, traditionally, I'm against Friday night football high games school. for college because of high school. And actually, I really appreciate Jim Harbaugh stepping up and saying this years ago when he first took the head coaching job at Michigan. Like, leave Friday nights for high school football teams, so you don't have to force people who want to watch. Understand that. You know, Notre Dame or USC play a Friday night game when their children may be playing a high school game that night. So traditionally, I'm in favor of leaving that slate open for high school. But we're talking about January for these games. Yes. So you wouldn't be competing with high school games because they're already done with their championship. So when it comes to the semifinals and the finals, if we can't play it on a Saturday, then pick the Friday night. Somebody in the comments, give me a reasoning why we played on Monday. I don't want any corporate BS or whatever because it's not true. You'd make just as much money, if not more. Think about if your team was playing out in Scottsdale and you're from Auburn. You're playing on a Friday, which means I can go out there, let's say on Thursday, watch the game Friday and stay the weekend if I want and leave on Sunday. Now, if I want to go watch the national championship game on a Monday, I got to fly out there during the weekend, wait all day, watch the game Monday night, and then have the rest of the week to have to go work. You're screwing us. That's what you're doing. And I'm tired of it. I'll die on this hill. There's not a lot of uh, hills hills I'll die on. I'll die on this. Is Is there a lot of dills? You would die. No, I'm not a Dill guy. I'm a bread and butter pickle guy. Good for you. Yeah. Wickle guy as well. Love Wickles. Yeah, it's great. The best Phenomenal. pickles there are. Hated. But speaking about the best. Great. Love them. Never had one. Fantastic. Don't lie to my face. Hey, YouTube, do us a favor real quick. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Turn that notification bell on. And if you didn't know already, we do a weekday show every morning, 7.30 a.m. to 9 a.m. Eastern. Come check us out. Live calls, live interaction with the chat. And we're covering sports like a warm blanket in the wintertime. We appreciate it.